So in the last video, we uh, finished uploading uh, images to storage and saving pointers in the database and also creating our post objects. So now we, we have posts in the database, uh, but we ran into a problem. Uh, the images were rotating. This is kind of a known issue with some Samsung devices. I know they do it. I don't know of any other ones, but definitely Samsung, some of them will do it. So in this video, we'll fix that rotation. Originally, I was going to type out the whole class, but I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm just going to paste it in and you can get it from my GitHub page because it's, I don't know, it's kind of boring. I find it boring. So I think it's just going to be faster if you just get it from my GitHub page. Uh, so let's just create a new class in the utility package and we're going to call it rotate bitmap. And inside of rotate bitmap, we'll handle the rotation. So I'm just going to copy in everything. So literally copy pasting everything in there. And I'll just go to the description of this video and get go to the, my github page and just copy this um, this out and you'll notice that it's getting an error here uh, so we, we need an extra dependency this this library was this is this is a special library that we're using so go into project go into your build.gradle app file and we're gonna paste in the uh, X if interface support library so actually I'm gonna put it up with the other support libraries oh it's just up here uh, so com android support exif interface 26 26 plus or whatever version you're using and hit sync and that's what we're going to that's what uh, we're going to use to actually uh, rotate the image and it's giving me that error still because it probably has the wrong library delete that one so now i want the support one so get the android support dot media library and there we go so uh, basically, just kind of in a nutshell, what this class is going to do, uh, the default constructor, or the constructor will take a bitmap and then a degree, and what it will spit out is a rotated image, depending on if it was rotated. Basically, it checks the orientation, so you can see this switch, switch statement down here. It checks the orientation, and depending on what it was rotated, it will then rotate it and return the corrected orientation. That's, that's basically all it does. So what we can do is go into post fragment and inside of our do and background task right here when we um, convert the URI to a bitmap, what we want to do is rotate it. So we can delete this line or just change this line. Uh, so we're going to go above and do rotate bitmap. Uh, we'll just call it rotate bitmap equals new rotate bitmap and then do rotate bitmap dot handle sampling and rotation of bitmap and then pass the context so we can just do get activity and then we can pass our URI whoops just like that so that that will now handle the rotation and also the conversion of the URI to the bitmap okay so that's kind of all I wanted to do in this video uh, that should handle the rotation issue that I know is, happens on Samsung's for sure uh, but let me know in the comments if you have any devices that the rotation still occurs uh, and just like comment what device it was and make sure you comment if it was if you were uploading image from uh, from the phone's memory or if you were uploading an image from the camera uh, and yeah I'll see if I can get back to you and figure out what's going on with that particular device so that's it for this video in the next one we'll start working on I guess displaying posts so retrieving posts let me just take a look at the app because we, yeah, so now we have a way to post things. Uh, so the next part is, yeah, again, taking a look at what posts we have and filtering and all that stuff and integrating Elasticsearch. So I'll see you guys in that next video.